So, uh, thinking this week about um, somebody's theory that the book of Mark and the New Testament of the Bible should not have several verses at the end of it, and uh, let's uh, let's give an answer from the scriptures themselves. The sexiest book of the Bible, Song of Solomon, uh, chapter 7, ends with a verse. I'll read it to you here. The mandrakes give a smell, and at our gates are all manner of pleasant fruits, new and old, which I have laid up for thee, O my beloved. New and old. Okay, there's there's the key to the answer. The uh, theory that uh, the extra verses at the end of Mark chapter uh, 16 uh, if they leave those off as they're somewhat disputed being in the original text, um, you leave those off and you've got only 666 verses to Mark. And uh, six, the number of man. Uh, you get Mark of the Beast. Uh, curious, curious theory there. Uh, and here, if we go the full text, you've got 678 verses. Uh, Song of Solomon, chapter 7, is the 678th chapter in the Old Testament. So the answer to the mystery of why all those verses are in there, why they're needed, why they're necessary, 678 in the New, 678 in the Old. Solomon says, All manner of pleasant fruits, new and old, which I have laid up for thee, O my beloved. Scripture answers itself. Uh, it's a holographic puzzle that has uh, many of our answers that we need for living every day.